Anna Green Gables is the story of a young orphan girl who is adopted by an elderly couple who are brother and sister, and of her experiences growing up in a fictional town of Avonlea. It's a story of how this very precocious, very proud, very determined little girl ends up changing the lives of so many of the people in the community around her. Working with Colleen Dewhurst is a wonderful experience. She is an amazing lady. You don't feel intimidated with her because she is so wonderful and you know the reputation she has. That can be intimidating in a sense, but she just makes you feel so at home. They always say Colleen is down to earth, but she really just, there's no nonsense with her. And when she works, uh, she likes to have fun. So there's no kind of, uh, you don't feel inferior. She doesn't treat people badly at all. So she's just a really nice, great lady to work with. And you, it may be all behind you, but what's in front of you is 50 crew members and the camera and they are but the last thing that looks period so you, you just really have to block it out and have a pretty strong sense of what you think what you know your feeling of the period is what I really need is concentration and especially when it's demanding that you be uh, in a, experiencing a certain emotion whether it's like the funeral scene in the sequel where you're crying I for me I just need time to focus because if I can get my concentration and I can focus my energy, then I, I can pretty much conjure up the feelings that I need to uh, from the scene. I could use it again. You can just bite it from the top. Okay. 361, take one. Action. How oh, I shall miss you, Emma. We will see each other again soon. And I promise you, I won't ever forget you. Just you mind that. I will. Goodbye, Miss Shirley. I think the most difficult thing one is shooting is the actual principal photography production. You're always under the gun in terms of uh, time and money. And the most horrible thing, actually, is not having the time at the end of the day or being up against weather or something like that where you can't get exactly what it is you want. We'll start tomorrow and start from scratch and everybody knows what they're doing now since we've had a chance to rehearse the buggies and the horses and the sheep and we'll just start in the morning and keep on going. I think you're quite good looking. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. <laughs>